Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam amma ba'da habitin fillah it's well known that the sabil al-sunnah the way of the sunnah of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa alihi wa sallam is the way for success in this life as well as the hereafter Sabila Sunnah. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless us to be of those who traverse that path. Because the Sabila Sunnah is the menhaj of the Salaf. And there is no other menhaj after that. And in a beautiful narration of An Ubay bin Kaab radiallahu ta'ala anhu قال عليكم be sabil wa sunnah fa innuhu laysa min abdin ala sabil wa sunnah dhakara rahman fa fadat aynahu min khashyatillah fa tamassahu al-nar wa laysa min abdin ala sabil wa sunnah dhakara rahman fakshara jilduhu من خشة الله عبي بن كعب رضي الله تعالى عنه said it's upon you السبيل والسنة bath water إن شاء الله take ice baths yeah he said that it is upon you the sabil wa sunnah the path and the sunnah of the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam of course that's the sirat allah and he said that there isn't a slave or he said it's upon you the sabil wa sunnah and verily there is not a person or a slave that is on the sabil wa sunnah on the path and the sunnah that remembers a Rahman, the most merciful. And his eyes become, you know, tears begin to fall from his eyes. They well up with tears from the fear of Allah. That this person, the fire will not, will not touch them. And there isn't a slave that is on the Sabil or Sunnah who remembers a Rahman. And his skin becomes uh, sensitive, and the hairs begin to rise upon his his skin from the fear of Allah. Except that he will have success, and his sins will be removed. So alayna bi sabil wa sunnah And we ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil And bless us to be on the straight path of Suratullahi al-Mustaqeem Wa sallallahu wa sallam Ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam